What's up everybody, it's your boy Mighty Go. we're back again with another video. Today's video, we have got a special video. This is probably the weirdest video I've ever made in my entire life. Guys, what I was wondering is what would happen if Clayton Kershaw and Bartolo Colon had a freaking kid. <laughs> no, I know a lot of you guys are gonna say, oh Mighty Go, that's impossible, they're two guys. Well, science nowadays, I don't know, you never know. You never know, maybe they could have a kid. That'd be pretty dope if they did, but I created the most epic player of all time. Let me show you. <laughs> Here he is, boys. Clay Tolo Kirsch alone. <laughs> I might have just murdered that. Clay Tolo Kirsch alone. Kirsch alone. It's hard to say. You try to say it. I give you a dollar if you say it right. But yeah, there he is. There's Clay Tolo. He's pretty much a beast. He's got, uh, let's see his pitches. He's got a four seam, change up, curveball. And then you got to have that Bartolo two seam in there and then the slider as well. He's left handed. He throws just like Clayton Kershaw. He's 5'9, 232 pounds. And he's pretty much a freaking beast. Pretty much a freaking beast. We're going to see how good he can end up doing. But let's freaking do it. Yeah, right, guys, there he is. He's a 99 overall. And I did put him on the Red Sox just because, you know, why not? Why not? And uh, what we're going to do is we are going to simulate a month at a time and see how well he ends up doing. So we're going to simulate through date. And then we're going to see uh, we're gonna see how well he's doing. Uh, Drew Pomeranz, whatever. No one freaking cares about you, bro. Good God, auto-utilize. Auto There's so many notifications nowadays. Auto, holy God. Why are there so many injuries, dude? Is everyone getting injured? Oh, my God. Auto. Jesus Christ! Why is everyone getting hurt? Oh my god, sorry, I'm kind of losing my voice. Dude, why was there so many freaking notifications? Oh my god. But alright, dudes, let's go check out how well Clay Tolo is doing real quick. Alright, so uh, Clay Tolo is absolutely killing it. <laughs> He's 4-0 with 49 strikeouts at a .92 ERA. Is currently listed as day to day. Is that a baby. That a baby, dude. <laughs> and then uh, Chris Sale's actually doing pretty bad. 4.3 ERA. Right? But look at Clay Tolo Kirsch alone. What an absolute stud. And so's Kimbrel. What's Kimbrel doing? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. But let's see here. Should we go and... I need to turn off those things real quick. All right, guys. So I changed it so there shouldn't be as many... Uh, as many, uh, what, 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 am, what am I trying to say here? Uh, 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 as many notifications. Wow, I'm an idiot. But, uh, yeah, so we're going to simulate another month. Kersh, or er, sorry, Clay Tolo Kersh alone is absolutely killing it. So we're going to simulate through day. Yeah, we're getting, like, no notifications now. Finally, finally. But, yeah, hopefully he continues to do good. Do good. Hopefully he wins a Cy Young. That'd be pretty freaking legit. But, yeah, guys, if you have any ideas as to who you want me to make a baby, if you want it to be Mice Trouper. That was horrible. <laughs> that was horrible. But I'm trying. To, I was trying to say Mike Trout and Bryce Harper. But uh, yeah, we might make them. I also made Chris not for sale. We might bring him to the actual squad and see how well he does. But let's go ahead and check out how well Clay Tolo Kershalone is doing. He's actually not hot anymore. Uh oh. Uh oh. Please be hot still. Please be doing good. Here's what happened on the diamond yesterday. All right. So he's five and one. He's got 90 strikeouts with a 2.56 ERA. He got lit up a little bit there lately, but hey, that's fine, dude. You know, he's got he's still got a 2.5. Chris Sale is heating up. He's got a 292. Wow. Wow, boys. That might be the one and two in the league right now. Holy butthole. Holy butthole. David Price is doing good too. How's Rick Purcell? Yeah, trash. Drew Pomeranz. Hey, he's off the DL, but he's got a 4.95 ERA. All right. Well, uh, we're gonna simulate another month. Month, see how well he ends up doing too. So we're what month are we in? We're in June. Okay, we still got a lot of the year left. We still got a lot of the year left, which is freaking legit. Hopefully, he ends up getting like 23 wins with a sub one ERA. That'd be pretty freaking legendary. Actually, hopefully, he doesn't get hurt because that would suck. But why are the Red Sox doing so bad? They have freaking Clayton Kirsch alone and Chris Sale. What the f? Why, why is it still simulating? Okay, we'll stop it there. Once again, let's go check out how well he's doing. All right, boys. Him and Chris Sale are heating up. Oh god, it's getting interesting. So he is five and three with a 272 ERA and 130 strikeouts. Okay. So his numbers are pretty good. His ERA or his uh, win loss record kind of sucks. The Red Sox just might not be putting up any runs or whatever. But let's see how well Chris Sale's doing. Ten and four with a two four. No! Chris Sale's doing better than Clayton Kirsch alone. No! What the F, dude? Oops. What the F. Oh my god. Well. Clayton Kershaw needs to step it up or else uh, he's not going to win the freaking Cy Young. So we got it one more month. Hopefully he steps it up this next month. We are now in the all-star break here. Simulate through day. So we're going to have to skip all this crap. Bada bada ba ba. No. Skip. No. Okay. No. No. Okay. God, I hate that month. 
or that day, whatever. But yeah, we are almost done through July. Uh, the Red Sox are stepping up a little bit. They're ten. They're about ten games above 500. Let me simulate through date real quick. Boom, boom, and they're 56 and 49. Okay, Clayton Kershaw is due up next, but he's hot still. All right, so he's 8-3. He got a couple more wins. 172 strikeouts, 2.88 ERA. Not too bad. Not too bad. All right, let's see how well Chris Sale's doing. Ba -ba 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 -ba. He's 12-5 with a 2.52 ERA with 159 strikeouts. So Clayton Kershaw has more strikeouts. He's got a higher ERA. Uh, yeah, so I mean, it's close. He's got a better whip. I mean, they're pretty much neck and neck. They're pretty much neck and neck. But yeah, we're going to simulate, you guessed it, another month. And so what, August? Hopefully they make the postseason. Simulate through date. Hopefully they make the postseason. Uh, no, we don't want to make a trade deadline. No. Keep going. Why do they lose so much? What the F? All right, now they're on a little win streak, and now they're on a little losing streak. Okay. Let's sweep the Yankees. Dang it. We almost swept the Yankees. Whatever. Yankees win, win, win. Ha ha. We swept the Yankees. You guys suck. But let's see here. So we are almost done through August. The Red Sox are 73 and 61, so they might make the postseason, but you know it. Let's check out how well they're doing. All right, so David Price, Sale, and Clayton Kershaw alone are all hot right now. That's pretty dope. 9-5 and five with a 3 ERA. No! You're going the wrong way, Clayton. Clay Tolo. Sorry. Clay Tolo, Kershaw alone. So he's got a 3.06 ERA, 216 strikeouts. Chris Sale has a 2.68, 204 strikeouts. No! Chris Sale's going to win the Cy Young. David Price is doing good, too. God dang it, Clayton. Come on. Or Clay Tolo. God dang it. I keep saying Clay to Clayton, whatever. Okay, boys. Last month. We need some we need some big starts by Clay Tolo. Oh, okay, no one cares. Okay, no. Oh my god, there's so many of these things. Jesus. Jesus. Okay. Uh no. Oh my god. I hate some I hate these things, dude. Please make the postseason. Oh my god. I don't think they did good enough. I don't think they did good enough. No, hang on. Let's see how well everyone did. All right, so Clay Tolo ended up going 10-6 and six with a 2.81 ERA and 272 strikeouts. Chris Sale, 2.82 with 236 strikeouts. Okay, so he had like 40 more strikeouts. He actually ended up with a better ERA. A worse one-loss record and less innings. Interesting. Boys, Clay Tolo might be the Cy Young. He might be the Cy Young. But let me simulate the rest of this real quick. Where are we at? Let me go here. Simulate through date. We made the freaking postseason, boys. We made the postseason, boys. And it's Clay Tolo. Come on. Come on, Clay Tolo. Please freaking win this thing. Please freaking win this thing. Come on. Come on. Come on, Come on Clay Tolo. Let's go. What a start. What a start by Clay Tolo. Oh, my God. 11 strikeouts, 8 innings pitch. Let's freaking go. Oh, my God. I can freaking dig it. I can dig it. All right, now we're playing the Indians. Uh, he's got Chris Sale on the mound. Simulate through date. Ah, poopy, poopy. We're going to simulate. All right, here's Clay Tillow's next start. All right, let's see if he can win this thing, though. God dang it, dude. Kershaw alone gave up four runs. No. No. Hey, look at look at Kimbrel though. Struck out five of five batters, which is pretty dope. But God dang it, dude. Uh, Clayton Kershaw did not help the Red Sox win the World Series. Well, we'll see how well he ended up doing though. Let's see if he ended up winning the uh, Cy Young. He probably did. I don't know how he won it. Have let's see it real quick. All right, so the MVP went to Edwin Encarnacion. He went. He batted 307 with 44 bombs. Okay, pretty solid year. Jesus. Jesus, as a DH. All right, let's see. Cy Young. Let's go. Wait. No. What the F? I mean, I'm still happy Chris, uh, Chris Sale won. But why did Clay Tolo not win? What the F, dude? Oh, my God. Did he win anything? Rookie of the... Oh, he won Rookie of the Year. God dang it, dude. Freaking Clay Tolo. What the F, bro? No! Well, guys, unfortunately, Clay Tolo Cologne, the offspring of Clayton Kershaw and Bartolo Cologne, uh, he did good. He did good, but he did not win a Cy Young, an MVP, or a World Series. Uh, we, you know, we really want to see one of those. But I might make another one between, like, Mike Trout and Bryce Harper or, I don't know, freaking Puig and someone i don't freaking know yeah dudes if you enjoyed this video i know it was freaking weird but it was just fun to do it was fun to do make sure you smash like on it 
leave a comment below hit that subscribe button if you guys are new like i said i will be doing another video like this in the future let me know in the comments below who you guys want to see have a kid it's gonna be freaking lit but guys i'm out i love you all so much peace